finally, finally, finally in China. 14 hour flight. You ever been on a 14 hour flight? It's kind of long and not long at the same time. Um, you know, I got in town and the U.S. was playing last night. And unfortunately, um, they lost to France uh, last night, this morning. I don't even know what time zone we're in. We're going back and forth. But, you know, um, I think what they said, that was the first uh, loss since 2006 in Greece. And I was on that team that lost to Greece. You know, but hey, man, 50-something in a row, what, 56 games in a row, that's pretty good, man. The world's catching up. Uh, you know, phenomenal basketball players. Rudy Gobert had a great game last night, um, you know, leading that team. Uh, you know, Fournier and all those guys in Batum, you know, the NBA guys really leading uh, the young French guys. But, you know, it's great for basketball. It's great for basketball. Kids in, you know, uh, France are going to look at that uh, time and really remember that. Um, you know, it's been a long time for the USA, but you know, hey, we gotta, we gotta get back on it. You know, get, gotta get it back together. Quick fun fact before I get out of here. Did you know they have to continue to play? Fifth place game and seventh place games are still on the docket. So go USA, man. We still gotta, um, you know, finish it out. Cause yeah, you know, it sucks playing for fifth, but probably sucks worse playing for seventh. So we got a big game uh, against what I think Serbia tonight and uh, we gotta get that one. So go USA.